What we're going to be taking a look at in this example is Alias Design for Inventor. Alias Design for Inventor allows us to make use of some of the alias tools directly inside the Autodesk Inventor 2011 interface. Now with this tool we have the capability to push and pull geometry as we see here on the screen. As I create or grab these different points I have the ability to stretch and pull those pieces of geometry that I create. Now I don't only have the ability to create or pull, push and pull endpoint geometry, but I also have the ability to add additional point sections on my components so that I can get a more well-defined piece of geometry that I'm trying to output. And I can output or pull those components in any direction. I can make use of my view cube to easily grab new directions and understand exactly how I'm updating or influencing my model. And very easily in Autodesk Inventor 2011, I have the capability to do this.